There are special keywords that, when used in conjunction with most general keywords, such as dog grooming or digital photography or air travel, can help you quickly find some useful and helpful information re related to that particular topic. Here are some examples of these special keywords. They include things such as tips, articles, news, blogs, guide, checklist, FAQs, resources, information, facts, secrets, things like that. So how do you use these special keywords? Well, it's really quite simple. Instead of searching for something like dog grooming, we'll come over here and type in dog grooming. Instead of just searching for something like that, you'll incorporate some of these special keywords into your search to find useful and helpful information. So for example, instead of just typing in dog grooming, I'll type in dog grooming tips to find information about dog grooming tips, some how-tos, some some strategies for making sure I do it properly or I can instead of dog grooming tips I can replace tips with another special keyword such as articles find uh, a lot of articles that address how to go about dog grooming or I can type in dog grooming guide to find uh, guides about grooming my dog and once again, guide, tips, articles, these are just special keywords that you add to your search that help you to sift through all the information about dog grooming that may be available and find just the stuff that's going to help you learn how to do it better. So let's take a look at another example. Another example would be using uh, air travel. So instead of just air travel, and so looking at some of the results related to that, which you'll see are things like Expedia, Travelocity, Orbitz, things like that, that may not be real helpful if we want to learn how to do air travel better. But if we use some of these special keywords, such as tips, I'll put tips at the end of my search, you can, find, you can see that Google now returns uh, information from sites all over the web related to uh, teaching you how to become a better air traveler such as travel.yahoo.com 20 air travel tips from insiders that would be useful for learning how to do air travel better or how about uh, air travel guide once again some more additional information to teach you how to air do air travel better or air travel checklist and there you go. There you get a packing, uh, packing checklist, planning your trip, air travel checklist, which is a Word document right there, power travelers checklist. Use these special keywords to sift through all the stuff that's on the web about a particular topic and find the stuff that's really going to help you learn how to do it, whatever you're looking to do, even better.